Flags are at half staff across Franklin County tonight as the community mourns the loss of a long serving first responder. Lloyd Rudiger served in the New Haven Berger Fire Department for decades before suffering a duty related heart attack on Monday. Five on your side's Holden Kerwicki was in Berger today as the community honored a man who spent his life keeping them safe. For over 59 years, Lloyd Rudiger served at the New Haven Berger Fire District and was on seemingly every call. So it's only fitting that on the day he's laid to rest, he made one final stop at his favorite place. It was his life. It, it gave him a reason to get up in the mornings and it gave him purpose. This is the last alarm assignment. As a radio blared out the 84 year old firefighters last call. Firefighter Rudiger gave his life in the line of duty. Rudiger's niece, Brenda Turnbaugh, couldn't help but be emotional. I'm just amazed that he had so many people who were interested in him that they would pay their last respect. Who's that? Oh. You know, the brotherhood is the brotherhood, and we're going to be there. Retired firefighter Richard A. Holt made the trip from Creve Corps to pay his final respects to a man who served in the U.S. Army before working as a truck driver and spent nearly six decades as a firefighter, teaching generations a simple lesson along the way. Dedication, dedication to their community, uh, dedication to the service and the brotherhood of, of, the, of the fire service. In fact, one of Rudiger's final acts was responding to a house fire Sunday night before suffering a presumed duty-related heart attack Monday morning. But Turnbaugh told Five on Your Side her uncle wouldn't have wanted it any other way. It, it was his life, and he got to do what he liked doing and enjoyed doing it. Know that, you know, no matter where you are, the fire service is your family. Reporting in Berger, Missouri, Holden Kerwicki, Five on Your Side. Ruder was buried at St. Paul Cemetery in Berger. The Missouri Fire Service Funeral Assistance Team and backstoppers are assisting his family.